morning. Hey guys. Good morning. Thanks for hopping in there, Dabbling Chef. Nice to see you. I haven't been on Periscope in so long. Good morning, guys. Good morning, Creative T. Thanks for hopping in here. I don't think you've been in any of my scopes before, but thanks. Thanks, guys. Thanks for the hearts. Good morning, everyone. I just wanted to hop on. It's been so long since I've been on Periscope. I miss you guys. <laughs> Good morning. Good morning. How do you say your name? Is it Ivy's? Good morning, Jeepster. Thanks for hopping on, guys. Good morning, everyone. You're new to me. Yes, I've been watching you, though, and your mo your grandmother. Is it? It's your grandmother, right? She's like 100 years old. <laughs> That's amazing. Ivy. Great. That's a nice name. I like it spelled that way. Good morning. Thanks, guys. Good morning, everyone. I just wanted to hop on this morning. Oh, she's awesome. She's such an amazing woman, your grandmother. It's awesome. Um, but I just wanted to hop on this morning real quick, guys. I'm even holding the camera. It's not even on a tripod because I won't be on very long but I wanted to share my favorite things I signed up with Bonnie L Frank for her true you challenge so I don't know if you guys are following her if you're not following Bonnie and you're on Periscope for um, any type of business reasons you'll want to hop on there and check her out she has all kinds of neat tips and tricks um, and information about Periscope and Blab and Mevi. she does all those great things that she can help you guys out with so um, if you haven't been on one of my scopes before. Let me introduce myself. My name is Keyshell. I, um, oh gosh, I don't even remember how to introduce myself. I've been, haven't been on here in so long, <laughs> but thanks to all the live viewers. Thanks to all the replay viewers. If you're watching me on Twitter or on the web, I really appreciate you hopping on. Yes, thank you for tapping on the screen and giving me some hearts. If you're here on the app, you can do that. It's a great way to just show your appreciation for the scoper if you're new to Periscope. Um, you can also swipe left or right or up or down, depending on what type of device you're on. And you can share this out to your followers, your friends, your Twitter followers, your Facebook. You can copy, link it, send it in a text, whatever, um, if you're interested in doing that. But I wanted to hop on and share my favorite things. And one of the things I'm going to share, I'm going to show you guys, because... I didn't realize that it wasn't like normal and as I was making it this morning I rem reminded me that this is my favorite thing like completely favorite I love pancakes for breakfast but this right here has anyone else had this am I the only one that eats this like it feels like strange to think that no one else is waking up and having eggs and rice for breakfast I mean that's all it is it's just eggs rice some butter, some garlic salt, and some pepper. And I absolutely love it. It's like, it's like family to me. Like, it's like when I have that now, it's like family. It's like, I think of all my grandmas and all my aunts and all my cousins because apparently no one else <laughs> eats it. It's really strange the um, way I found this out that it's not a normal thing because you think things are normal growing up is um, we had, we've had eggs, rice, and salmon. Going to try it now. Please try it. I absolutely love it, Christine. It's so delicious. Probably not the healthiest breakfast, <laughs> but it's definitely better than a bowl of cereal. Um, of course I have kids. I have five kids. And so you normally have your little sleepovers and we do pancakes in the morning or cereal or whatever. And one morning, one of the kids, I don't remember which one, asked for the eggs and rice. And we had, you know, friends over and I made it and all the friends were like, what is this? Like, what are you, what what is this food you're giving us? And they had never had it, never heard of it. So that was when we realized, hey, we eat something completely different from everyone else. I don't know where my family got it from or why they started making it, but I absolutely love it. We crave it. The kids beg for it. Um, but yeah, it's just some scrambled eggs. If you do like two eggs and one cup of rice, that's usually a good ratio. And some garlic salt, some pepper, and some butter to taste. And it's just crave worthy amazing delicious i love it um and that is my favorite thing and i'm not big on favorite things so it was hard for me to do this scope i'm actually a couple days behind on the true you challenge and um my other favorite thing is blue of course my phone right now is on a blue case my water bottle is blue you think you'll try it you love rice definitely should try it i remember when i was really really little i went to a different grandmother's house um my dad's mother was no longer with us unfortunately and my great grandmother was there my grandma easter and she asked me baby what do you want for breakfast and i was like oh i want eggs and rice and she was like okay and she went away and she came back with a plate of rice and butter i cried i literally cried that that morning she was like what's the matter i'm like where's the eggs I had never had rice and butter, which I guess is a thing for other people. Um, 
and she didn't hear the eggs part. She just heard rice because she's used to making rice and butter. So anyways, that's my little story about my favorite thing. And like I said, now when I make it, um, knowing that it's so special to me and my family and not just something that everybody in America pretty much eats for breakfast, it makes me feel special and think of my grandmas and think of my cousins and people that I may have lost along the way and, you know, that shared this meal with me for breakfast. So that's it for this morning, guys. Also, I was originally going to say my favorite thing was my family, of course, because I love them. <laughs> but um, when it comes to breakfast, that's my favorite thing and it embodies my family and food all in one. So I really, really love it. But again, thanks you guys for hopping on. Um, again, my name is Keyshell with Beauty and a Mission. So you guys can check out my website if you like. There's a link in the profile that will give you some freebies where you can try out some of our beauty counter products, which are some of the safest products in the industry. Completely transparent company. Um, we share every single ingredient with you that we put in our products. We even have a never list that shows you all the ingredients you should probably never use on your skin uh, since it is your biggest organ um, and that is my main business that I'm doing right now I also help people with social media marketing and small businesses with different things like that so if you guys need any information on those things please check it out and I will be back on later because I'm a few days behind on this challenge to put in some more of the challenge topics which I think the next one is a behind the scenes of your business so I'll show you guys a little bit more about that and then I don't know what the third one was but I'll check that out and do those and I'll be back on later I'm gonna run finish up my breakfast get my workout done and hang out with the kids thanks you guys for hopping on and saying hi it was nice meeting you all hope to see you guys around later hope to catch out some of your scopes if you scope have a great day i'll talk to you later bye bye beauties